And good morning. We are in the boardwalk lobby today, headed to Animal Kingdom, right? Yes, again. <laughs> Yeah, we were just there yesterday for our four parks plus Disney Springs in one day, but it was a, a whirlwind tour, so today is a more relaxed version. So we finally made it to Animal Kingdom. This one was a slow morning, but not our fault. Um, the bus took a really long time today. And then when they came, three Animal Kingdom buses came at one time. So I guess they just got bunched up, but um, we're here now. I love this view at um, Africa at Animal Kingdom. It's really well themed. Looks really cool. They've already got morning entertainment going up here. It's pretty early. Our first pass pass is Kilimanjaro Safari. I like to go early while the animals are still active. All right, this was a great use of a fast pass. It's only 9.20 and the standby line is all the way back to the very beginning. Yikes. Close your eyes for safari. Thank you, Marty. All right, that's what I'd like to say. I'm going to reserve one day for a couple weeks. Well, let's go. So, job of my friends, good morning. My name is Matt. I'm the rhino horn. Well, is a rhino. Right off to the right, you're going to see the bongos. Bongos are also known as the ghosts of the forest. We know how giraffes have the really long necks, too. But did you know they have the same number of vertebrae in that part of their body as we do? We each have seven bones in our neck. Which is kind of cool to think about. These are known as Ancoli cattle. Also known as Watusi cattle, based off the tribes. Who were the first ones to domesticate them? Those horns are their most striking feature by far. Now, elephants, when they're fully grown, they weigh around 11,000 to 13,000 pounds. Very, very large. Unfortunately, just like with rhinos, though, they're off. We had a great safari. All the animals were out and about because it was early enough in the day. And so now we're going to go do the Pangani Forest exploration trail because we have a few minutes before our next fast pass. We're in the aviary, a lot of activity this morning. Lots of birds. Here's a more up close view of the bird in the nest. How cute. So cute. Yeah. Yeah, he's digging away. How cute. All right, so that was a fun Pangani tour. Um, Brian just noted it's much less humid today. It does feel better so far. It's hard to tell later it might be miserable, but yeah. right now it feels good. All right, so I'm gonna go check out the Dawa bar. It was not open when we first got here, and for some reason I thought they opened when the park did, but apparently not. Yes. All right, so we stopped at the Dawa bar, and there's a lot of people here, but I think they're all waiting to get into Tusker House for break for the character breakfast. And I got the Chinza lemonade, and uh, it looks really tasty. I haven't tried it yet. Let me give it a try. Yeah, that's really good. It's, it tastes like lemonade, but special. <laughs> special lemonade. I love this view. Every trip I have to film it. I know you guys are probably sick of it, but I just think this is so well done. Like, the forethought to plan all this out to have that view, especially since Everest was put up after the fact. You know, it's fairly yeah. new, relatively speaking. Yeah, a helicopter. A helicopter. <laughs> They're ruining my Disney bubble. <laughs> helicopter can't fly that high. <laughs> We are headed off to our first, I mean, our second fast pass for Dinosaur. And Flick is out and at it again. We did him in October. Highly recommend meeting him if you get a chance. He's really a lot of fun. All right, so we're in Dino Land. We're on the search for a one of those photo booths that takes several pictures. We found out. Uh, through a message board that a bunch of those actually go to your memory maker So we did one on boardwalk and sure enough it showed up in memory maker, which is pretty cool 
I've heard there's one at Boardwalk, one here at this sort of carnival area, and also one at um, Space Mountain where you get off where the arcade used to be. I know there's a couple of others, but I'm not sure where they're located. Standby is only 10 minutes, so we're gonna go ahead and jump on Primeval World. So we're here for our next fast pass, which is Dinosaur. Yay! Also known as Indiana Jones. Yeah, I wish it was Indiana Jones. Lucky people in California. I'll close my eyes and just pretend it's You pretend? Jones, so. Welcome to our little trans-dimensional joyride, folks. I'm Dr. Seeker, your friendly controller, and a heck of a paleontologist, if I do say so myself. Can we go down here? All right, our final fast pass for Animal Kingdom is the Everest roller coaster, which we rode yesterday. There's actually a 60 minute standby wait for our Kelly River Rapids. That's not something that Brian and I ever did. We did it once and said, okay, that was nice. Um, neither of us particularly like having our shoes get soaked because we wear actual sneakers. And also, it's a really, really short ride. Um, yeah, super short. It's like, you, I don't want to wait in that long of a line for that short of a ride. All right, we're heading on to the Maharaja Jungle Trek. And if you watch our October vlogs, the bats were not out and a lot of animals were on vacation. So we're hoping to have better luck this time. Heading into the bat house. They were on vacation last time we were here, so hoping they are out. They must be as crowded as it is. So there's a bat right over there. I thought I saw one over there. And some bats right here. They look like they're napping. They probably don't look that impressive on video, but they're really large in person. Look at all those guys. These are really cool. I think so. He's beautiful. Yeah, believe me, he knows it too. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> He's making sure you see. <laughs> wow. It's not a catwalk, it's a pheasant walk. <laughs>
right, I went in the Maharaja jungle trek to see the bats and I came out more impressed with the pheasant. Who knew? He was fun. So, it is pretty packed today, but the lines haven't been bad. The only long line I've seen is the Cali River Rapids, probably because it's so hot. Yeah. And everything else, I think has been pretty reasonable. All right, we're back around to the front headed for a pizza safari for lunch. All right, so I'm sorry the lighting is very low in here. We're at Pizza Safari, and I got the Meat Lovers Gluten Free Pizza, which took even longer than usual for quick service gluten free food. I'm not complaining, I'm grateful they do it, but just that FYI, we need more time for it. And the Anapasta salad, Brian got the shrimp flatbread, which looks really good. The Safari Amber Ale and the Anapasta salad. So I already had a pizza of my shrimp flatbread. Oh, pizza before it's flatbread. It's really good. I really like the arugula on it. It really looks good. Yeah, the Safari Amber, Amber is actually pretty good too. I wasn't expecting much. I never had it here. I think it's special for it or unique to Animal Kingdom. Oh, I'm nice. I'm not sure. It might be. Hmm. Yeah, that's good too. Alright, so as you can see, I took a bite out of my gluten free meat lovers pizza, and I have to say it's really, really good. I was surprised. Um, it was worth the wait. Yeah, it actually was. Okay. It was really tasty. So we just finished at Pizza Fari, and here's one of the Avatar Land or Pandora um, scrims. I can't wait to see this, really. I'm not a huge Avatar fan, but I know Disney's going to do something amazing. I can't wait. Alright, so we're going to head into the Riverside Deep here. I like these lizards eating each other's tails here. That's cool. Kind of like Ouroboros. So apparently it's another Star Wars store at Animal Kingdom. So they have a big Jungle Book display due to the movie. I still haven't seen it yet. I can't wait to see it. Brian's super excited. He fell asleep during the original, so... The man boy? That's the man boy, right? <laughs> yes. I wanna be like you, boo -boo. I love the music from this movie. Alright, I truly had an awesome morning at Animal Kingdom. It's been fun. It's been relaxing compared to yesterday. Uh, my idea of a vacation. <laughs> And now we're headed to Epcot, Brian's favorite park, my favorite park. Epcot Flower and Garden. Flower and Garden Festival. It's funny, we feel like we haven't spent that much time there, even though we've been there every day. Still haven't got any food from the Italy booth. That's right. Actually, there's several booths. Is she sitting on a nest? I think so. Beautiful. Black Swan. Welcome home. Because there's no one out here to say that. <laughs> so we ended up coming back to our room since we're right next to Epcot to take a really short break and cool down a little bit. To me, it does not feel as hot as it has. It's hot, don't get me wrong, but it's I think it's high 80s instead of low 90s, which doesn't sound like a big difference, but it really feels better.